What is happening, y'all? Welcome to the Sunday stream. I'm gonna be playing some more Dogma today and avoiding the horde of people that are coming to my house. Right, all right, all right. So I've been doing a little bit of playing on my own, um, mainly just to get done the last stream where we wrapped up, we had like a cave up here we had to hit, and then we had like this cave and that cave, and there's a couple caves. So, uh, ended up playing as Magic Archer, got that knocked out, maxed the vocation at the same time. So, Magic Archer is now done. I got those caves done. And instead, we can focus on the good stuff, which the first thing we're going to do is uh even though there's nothing really here i want to do a full clear of drobnir's grotto just so that sarash knows where everything is at in drobnir's grotto so we're gonna head out there first so we are gonna be playing I warrior mean, today unless you doubt my and just direction. focusing focusing warrior entirely not gonna not worry about anything else there we go tall two I'm hoping this will teach Sirash more how to more how to, to fight. Hoping that by using Revivify when I'm on fire, I can teach Sirash to do it as well. Big old Minotaur. Can't wait to find out what's inside. There's also like a bunch of like little houses and shit around here. But uh, I actually found a, a new way to, well, I shouldn't say new way, but when I was playing Magic Archer, I decided to play it as a support class, just because last time I did damage, and, and damage Mystic Archer is insane. Like, it just... No, oh, why can't I go that way? What's happening here? That's weird. There's like a... Invisible wall here, and it won't let you go up it. That's very strange. That yeah, support Mystic Archer is pretty pretty interesting. It's a very different way to play the class. But I focused around, uh... I would put shields on people. I dropped Liliana out of the party, and I would handle the healing for the party myself. Um, and then I had my nuke and just Blaze Fang Arrow, just to get stuff off me. Bonds actually work like that? Copy your skills? It was a thing that a lot of people mentioned in Dark Arisen. I don't know if it was ever, like, proven. But the the idea was like, oh, you know, if you, if you use abilities a lot, your pawns will see that, and they'll, they'll understand that and use those abilities a lot, too. And so, that is... I'm gonna test if that works here, because right now... As good as Sirash is, there's quite a few things that he won't do. Like Sirash just won't use, uh, he won't use in spirit at all. If he is, you know, poisoned or whatnot, he just, it's like he doesn't even realize he has an ability that will get rid of poison. Lay down your arms or you hurt yourself. Here, an enchantment of cold to freeze our birds. And so I'm hoping that by showing him, like, hey, Srush, 
this is what we do. He'll be like, oh, that's what you do. Oh, that was the biggest whiff of the century. Hated on Rise of the Ronin, but it's actually a good game. I recommend you try it again. No. Stop. Let me explain something, bro. I did not like Rise of the Ronin. I didn't hate on it. I did not like it. I played it for 25 hours. I did not find it enjoyable. I thought it was bland. I thought the world felt fucking boring. I thought the graphics were subpar for what I would expect for an exclusive title. The combat did not have the rhythm that I would expect from a Team Ninja game. It's not some fucking conspiracy, okay? I didn't enjoy it. If you enjoy it, that's fine. I said in my review, hey, this isn't for me. Maybe it'll be for you. So maybe, maybe you can enjoy it. Just because I don't like something doesn't mean you're not allowed to enjoy it, bro. But it's not for me. And you coming in here and being like, well, you got to give it another chance. No, bro. Try not to get hit. Lest all that vim goes to waste. It's like me telling you, hey, bro, try when you suck my dick real fast. And you're like, what? No, I don't suck dick. And I'm like, no, nah, bro, just fucking try it. You're it's going to be good, bro. Just just put it in your mouth. No, I don't. I don't. I don't do that. How do you know, bro? You didn't give my dick a fair shot. Just put it. Just just suck on it. Just a little bit. You understand where I'm coming from here? I played the game. I don't like the game. Stop trying to sell me on the game. Their cries can startle other creatures. Just I do I don't I don't get it like I'm not I haven't been talking about dogma I have or I haven't been talking about Ronin I haven't been tweeting about Ronin I literally I did my preview of it and then I did my review where I was basically like this isn't for me if if I was gonna get this I'd wait for a sale and I moved on that was it that was literally the end of my involvement with Rise of the Ronin. Because I don't engage with things that I'm not enjoying. Should your pack grow over and people are like, no, 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 no. You got to give it another chance. Like, no, I don't. Stop. Just drop it. I don't, I'm not interested. Like, every day I get at least two or three comments from people that are like, you didn't give it a fair chance. You must have been biased because Dogma was coming out. Like, no, I had Ronin a fucking week before I had Dogma. I had a full week with nothing else to play that I dedicated to just Rise of the Ronin. Tried recording it, didn't really enjoy it. Tried playing it, laying in bed, was like, oh man, it's a little bit better if I'm just kind of like casual messing around. But ultimately it just, it just didn't vibe with me. And that's it, that's that's where the conversation should end. Oh, it didn't vibe for you, cool.
fucking Ronin conspiracy out here, dude. I have my ring on. Let's see. Let's... Mm, I'm getting down from here. Actually, I probably am with a wake stone, though. Are we taking a load off so soon? We've only just rested. It is enough to make. Do 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 do. Camp only when the need arises. How many people? Like I said, two, two to three per day. This is an obstacle. I'd and just it doesn't stop, bro. I am poised to strike. Just say the word. There's, there's even like Reddit posts about like, a, like people acting like it's a fucking conspiracy. Like, and the thing is, I'm not, I'm not like alone in this judgment. Like ACG had had basically the same points I did and said it was like a wait for a sale game. But I don't think he has people breathing down his dick to explain his reasoning. He said it was more Assassin's Creed though, and that's where I disagree. People look up to reviews and that gave a bad preview. It the, the fuck it did. Are you kidding me? You go around the map. It's it's a checklist RPG. That's what Assassin's Creed is. It's absolutely a checklist RPG. There's nothing to disagree with here. I'm sharing a factual opinion about something. You pull up a menu and you go down a list to accomplish stuff. That isn't that, that isn't an opinion. Just murders everything, bro. So good. This is Dragon Spite. Is that the... Oh, it's like the baby version of the one Sirash has. That's cool. Would that we might always be so in step, eh? The Meister skill is very difficult to use. It takes a long time. Ice will be most effective against this foe. That was impeccably timed, Arisen. Like, to really maximize your damage with uh, the Meister skill, the target has to be knocked down, and you have to get the follow-up attack. If you miss the follow-up attack, you barely do damage. Let me be the one to collect it. I don't look at Ghost as a checklist RPG, because Ghost, the exploration is organic. Like, you're wandering around, and then you see something, and you go and accomplish it. Whereas in Ronin, you have a map with a list that you go down and accomplish objectives. I say we give it a push and see what happens. If you please. 
Okay, that's done. There's a griffin I get to later. It is clear you're not interested in arriving at our destination, so I'll hold off on guiding us there for now. Perhaps the ambitious is the fault of the pressing beast. Get my magic ground to an elemental beast. Ah. That fault ah. arisen. More victories like that, and we'll have a running for the hill. Oh, yeah. Not bad. You say about the people say this game is too short i don't uh, they're they're skipping content we're at 55 hours and i haven't even gotten to the post game yet and this is the this is basically an equivalent of like we're we're going close to a 100 percent play style so we're at 55 hours and another big thing to keep in mind is we know where everything's at Oh shit. Get off me. Slimes are brutal. Yeah, I've seen some people say they they're like, oh I beat the game in like forty hours, it's not that long. Like, you you skipped a lot of stuff. We're at 55. We are getting close to the end of Act 2. I haven't done anything in the post game yet. I don't think I'm gonna get platinum just because I don't feel like collecting secret tokens. sword you purchase it from the dragon forge i think it's it might only be uh new game plus that he sells these weapons but it might he might also in post game i'm not sure we're gonna we'll, we'll be at post game soon like we're gonna reach post game either uh today or tomorrow an enchantment of cold to freeze our foes. Could you come over here? Jose, I'm gonna be honest, bro. No one, no one cares. Like, no one. Ca we're not. That's not what we're playing here. Like, move on, bro. prefer to stay far away from that. Tis like there's not some manner of trap. Quite right. Let sleeping dogs lie, as they say. Mm -hmm. Warrior Meister is near the start of the game.
Yeah, hard mode's definitely added. Or needed. Is now invisible in this game. No few times have an overconfident step soaked my boots. You too? I'm glad I'm not there. Yeah, I love how this sword looks when it's ice enchanted. Fire enchant looks okay. Lightning enchant, not as big a fan of. But the ice enchant looks good. Just leave me to the I have Ron spawn along. Get out of the sky. Sarage! The path to victory. The enemy slows. Perhaps we'll tire them out. Ha! They don't stand a chance against us now. Strike fast and true, and our quarry shall fall. Rip. You will be remembered, Sarage. I'll go and open the chest. That was heroic as fuck, though. <laughs> I'm fucking taking it down to his end! I had a, as soon as he was like, I still have a hold of it, I was like, oh, I don't like this. This, this, this isn't gonna end well. This isn't gonna end well. Oh, shit. Damn it. Oh, well, we're almost through this. I'll, I'll resummon him when we get to the end. Ah, damn. I didn't think he was going to sacrifice himself to take out the griffin. Check that way. We gotta check this way. I knew you would prevail, Master. Uh, I made a cat man because I had played a human on my first playthrough, so just wanted to mix it up. Human the first time, cat the second.
Oh, yeah, I found Dorvin Enhancement a while ago. I already had it unlocked on the cons cast. I just didn't, I, I didn't know there was enhancement differences. Like, I knew that I was getting different upgrades, but it didn't click that where you upgraded mattered. Perhaps we might remove it by force. Ranged attacks are more special than So, ironically, had it unlocked without even knowing I had it. I think I go down first, if I remember. Then I shall remain by your side. Strongest attack, like for a warrior, or just in general? You mean? What is what is Ron's character doing? Why are you stuck on that? I might keep that ability on just for popping off Saurians, because it's pretty useful for that. We should be able to move this boulder with our combined might. Over here. Most fun? Uh, either warrior or thief, I think, are the two most fun. Oh, there's a ladder. I wonder how to connect to that. Yep. 
Uh, I do not know. Let's just keep going through it. We'll see if we can't find uh, find the connection for that. I mean, Sirach doesn't need the, the DCP. So we're just going to keep exploring. Trickster? Uh, it's strong, but it's like the participation trophy class. You don't, you don't really engage that much. So it's... I don't know. People, like, when people play Trickster, they're either going to love Trickster... Or I think they're gonna be like, nah. I don't think there's there's an in between with Trickster. You're either like, oh, this is fucking amazing, or you're just kind of like, eh. Yes, this this is still a new game. Get an XP without Sarash. Must we run everywhere? You are an impatient one, Arisen. Let us endeavor to keep up, though we are less fleet of foot. Avoid flame at any cost, Arisen. You have been cast in oil. Help! 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 Yes, Help! Master. Oh, they got it? Good job. <laughs> Please. Please stop the slime. I did. Stellar Blade is... I already played it on the K channel. It's uh, very good. Combat feels fantastic. It was well worth the effort of breaking it. Harpy snare, smoke beacon, so that can take me back to the fire. I don't know where else you're supposed to be able to get to with it. It's over that way. I'm flying all the way over there with it. I guess the idea is you could float down to the fire with it. But we are we are moving the opposite direction of that that mark. I'm curious how I get to that. So I found it on the basement floor, which means first floor should connect somehow. Or second floor. But that dead ended, that dead ended. The only thing I can think is there has to be a wall somewhere. Like a, a breakable wall that I missed. If I continue this way, I think we come up to the end of this. Oh no, I'm not I'm not getting it. Hang on. 
I need another explosive, I think. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, wait. Is it? I think it's because I already got it. Yeah, that's right. I got it the last time I was here, so that's already been done. So they're like, why are you not opening? You should be opening. That's a lot of fucking Saurians. Why should I use ice over fire? Because ice will freeze shit solid, which is good. Go boom. Watch your footing, master. Maybe I need to. I wonder if I need. Hmm. And we're going back. I'm gonna try something I haven't. I think I know how to get to that ladder. Warrior and Dogma is peak warrior. Like, A flawless execution. Literally, like, the some of the best Unga Bunga in the game. No question about it. You can fucking speed up your swings. You got fast swings. You get the shoulder check. Like, dude. Warrior in this game just feels fucking good. It feels really, really good. Notice the diversity of basic enemies in the original regular Saurians, Chameleon Saurians, Magic Bill Saurians. That's that's the same here. What do you mean? You got your regular Saurians, you got your Asp Saurians, which are poison, you got the Rock Saurians, which are much harder to hit, and then you have the bolt scales. We must go where we are bid. That's four different Saurian variants. So I think we're at the end almost, and I was thinking about how it gives you a harpy thing. I wonder if I'm supposed to use the harpy to fly, not there, but somewhere that's like up. Because it would just, it would be this way. So I think there might be like a ledge that I can hit. We got two. Let's try. Oh, 
Well, I'm not seeing anything. Except the campfire. Hmm. Maybe we are just supposed to go. I thought that was the campfire from earlier, but there's a chest over there that looks like I haven't gotten. Maybe it's a different campfire? It's gotta be that, yeah. Thought that was the same fire, but maybe not. That's well, definitely the fire I had before. No, it's not. It is a different fire. It is a different fire. There's like five chests over here. Oh, shit. Okay. Damn. I thought it was the same fire as the one we saw. skills all right well let's see what we find over here ring of eminence eminence I'm adding extra syllables we'll never get anywhere if all we do is rest it is enough to make Dread me only when the need arises Drake scale Kate and panacea and fruit, okay. So it's like the Saurian cape, but it's Drake scale instead, okay. And then what's the ring? Oh, it's just a knockdown? That's a good ring. That's a good ring. Yep. I even I saw that before. To proceed without light. I was like, no, that's not, that can't be it. What part of the map is that? This is, uh, Dropnir or whatever it's called, Drabnir. Is this a challenge arisen to see who can keep pace? Man, Ron's to keep up. on is... So we are less fleet of foot. Snippy, you know? So, uh, now we're just going here. Me thinks we could move this boulder if we work together. Me thinks we don't need to remove the boulder. basically like the southern tip of uh, Batal. If you're trying to go to the volcanic island, you have to go through here. Glad I came back. Part of me was like, I'm not going to bother with this. I've been here. I know what's in here. But I... Because when you're looking at that, when you're looking at that from the map, it looks like it's this campfire. I did not think there was a whole... They, they bamboozled you. There's a second campfire. What's funny is I actually saw that in my Let's Play and tried to get to it. And then later was like, oh, that's just the... That's where the griffin is at. Uh, 
Uh, we got the stagger ring and a dragon cape. I also didn't really explore. Oh, there's nothing to really explore down here, I guess. Wait, there's definitely shit to explore here. I gotta come back here soon. For reasons that I did not remember about, but now I am very much remembering. I don't have a port crystal on anyone, do I? Shit. Sarash usually has my port crystals. We're definitely coming back here for events. And there's so much I gotta redo in post game. Like it didn't even fucking occur to me to come by here. Use that one to get here. Okay, that should be fine. Uh, let's let's head out. We'll get Sarash. Um, yeah. Weapon skills early for warrior. Basically what I have, revivify, goring, arc of might, and then words under. Though early on, I wouldn't, I probably wouldn't use arc of might. Because arc of might is like real big stamina commitment. I might try and find a sorcerer that has celerity to see if I can arc of might faster. How do you farm fairy stones or do you buy them? Uh, you can farm them in post game and buy them and you find a lot of them in in chests like when you look at our map we have been hitting every fucking dungeon i've been trying to get every cave in the game and pretty often you'll get to the end of the cave griffin griffin follow me then unless you doubt my sense of direction griffin come here Time for the Daily Griffin. I'm right here, look at me. Look at me. No, 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 come up. Come up. I'm not coming down. You come up. No, you come up. Come up. Up here, dummy. I'm gonna have them on wait, and I'm gonna show y'all what I can do to a griffin as a warrior. If this griffin will fucking come up here. It's being kind of a little... Come on. Come on. I ain't jumping off this ledge and killing myself. You come up here. It's like just attacking oxen right now. Yeah. No. Nope. Oh, there we go. Where do you go? What? Come. No, you little shit. Bro, this griffin is just teasing me. Shall I show you there, master? So far away. Come back. Come back. I wanted to kill you. Oh, what a bitch. Let's go get Sarash. That griffin respawns every couple days, so it's usually a good griffin to farm. Yeah, well, that's what I was trying to do. Usually, if you, like, look at it and you use the go command, it'll, uh, it'll, like, intent, it'll sense your aggro and come after you, but it did not work there. Why? 
Cruise at your leisure, sir. Right, let's get Sarash back. We're gonna force that Griffin to respawn. Have materials here, master. Can we really afford to carry more? Feel weak as a fighter warrior? I mean, I get feeling weak as a fighter. You shouldn't feel weak as a warrior. Warrior. You are the Unga. Warrior, you, you really need the warrior core skills, though, to, like, start pumping, like, like, the progressively faster swings, the, uh, the charge attacks, the charge built-in parry, you need all that stuff. Ravening lunge, ravening lunge, Mike, no, null breaker is needed, null breaker is good, idle fury is good. I'm going to give Savage Lash a try. Sarash so has Roar. Mountain Breaker title. I think he might be better with Indomitable over Windstorm. I don't know if I've seen him use Windstorm. I also don't think Roar is fucking needed. We're gonna force that Griffin to come back. Show y'all a little trick. First, you go here and you waste your gold because it's closer than your house. It couldn't hurt to take a peek. The world's changing. I have no issue falling. Is it the warrior one level outside that stock gear? Yeah, I mean every class with stock gear is kind of kind of weak. Hey, we got the Sphinx finally. Sphinx Smiter, fuck yeah. Put all in storage. Alright, let's see. We got Sphinx down. Um or Chimera Conqueror, Medusa Mamer. Ogre Golem. Let's make him a Chimera. Twas just a, a good sleep does wonders. Off we go then. Feeling rested, I trust. For the 9999 in him because of the hospitality. <laughs> oh yeah, usually if it's morning though and you run over here, that griffin is back up and it's doing its patrols. Well met. Nah, the rich house is pointless. Don't don't waste your money. If you could like cook meals or something, like cook meals and put up trophies, maybe, but. It's just a regular house like any other. Your pawn, or as far as I know, earning those medals gives your pawn more knowledge about monsters. Is he not going to come? There he is, I hear him. Where is he at? I see a shadow, I don't see him. There he is. I shall lead us to our destination, so do try not to rush ahead. Well now, isn't this lucky? Someone who knows the way. It's about time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? I'm watching you. You really want me to come down there and fight you, huh? You're not gonna come up here and fight me on the... Right, just follow me. I will come down there if you stay. With that, hang on. Ah! 
Come on down. Are you, are you running? Come on. I'm giving you a fair chance to fight me one on one. One stagger. I need Mountain Breaker to really knock this fucker down. Where'd you go? Oh my god, they are all here. Oh, that's right, I forgot you gotta time that one. Alright, there's a lot of bullshit here. My good abilities. There we go. Come on. Here we go. Big Gunga Bunga. That's how you use Arc of Might. Took forever, but when you hit it, big damage. Was that three health bars? I don't know. Let me see. That would have been... Oh, let me rewind. It took forever to get it down. It's because I don't know. I have Null Breaker still, not Mountain Breaker. So the knockdown occurred when it had three, yeah, it had three full bars left. So we got the hit. Yeah, so we did three health bars worth with one arc of might. Chat. 
you see. Just the thing with Arc of Might, though, like, it's insanely strong if you get it perfect. And that's that's the problem with it. Like, because how, how the attack has, like, how it does this, that, that first swing, if that first swing doesn't connect, your Arc of Might isn't going to do anything close to that. It's going to do a fraction of the damage you would do otherwise. And that's that's why a lot of people, I mean, to be fair, it's still, still a long charge. It's still a very long charge, and it's a very high commitment, and it blows through all your stamina. But a lot of people are like, oh, it doesn't do damage. Like, I think when you consider the, the stamina and everything, it's, it's still underwhelming a bit. But the damage, if used correctly, is undeniable. The damage can be top-notch. And you can do that to, like, a dragon, too. You can do it to a dragon, you can do it to a cyclops. It's just it takes fucking forever to go off, and then you gotta hit that weak spot too. And that makes it, uh, down the challenging. We're gonna drop Liliana, I wanna try out, um... People were saying the haste will make Ark of Might charge faster, so I wanna test that out. One of us has been poisoned! My curative magics are at your disposal. I want to do a um any between sixty and sixty five a mage that has celebrity and then uh ideally celestial I can only search by one. Alright, well, let's give it celebrity. Aladum, Palladium, so, so that's just pure support pawn. Levin, Sucker, Celerity, and Haladum. I'd prefer Palladium and Celerity. Oh, there we go. Ice Affinity, Celestial, Celerity, and Palladium. So I won't have any attack. Levin, but that could be good. Celerity, Palladium, Arch, Sucker... Purient six. High celerity, palladium, lightning affinity, eleven celerity, halidum, and ice affinity. Palladium celestial, halidum celerity. Celestial celerity, palladium, ice affinity. We will add a marker to you, and there was another one that had that too. Okay, who are we looking at? Q. A well-organized pack is my specialty. I'll Logistician? Uh, I'm not really a big fan on Logistician. Her magic's also kind of low. What about the other one? Where's the other one? Where's the other one? My talents lie in combining materials, and I'll use those in my possession to craft things... Also Logistician. But better magic... Better fashion. I like this one. Liana, we are going to bring you back later. After I've had a chance to test stuff. Here you go. You can have a diss. At least I go knowing I fought to the best if of my... ever you need of an ear to listen. You have no, to... welcome to the Booty Legends. Follow me then. Unless you doubt my sense of direction. Ron's pawn is so uppity. Alright, let's do some quests though. We'll do a candle and a storm. I ended up, while I was uh, exploring last night, I went by the, uh, I went by the hot spring and I picked up this quest. Moldbreaker needs to level up. I want to give Savage Lash a chance and see how hard I can hit a weak spot with that. I think Windstorm is just outright better than Savage Lash, to be honest. But that's kind of what we're testing. Because the downside of Arc of Might is that it's very easy to blow through your stamina. And that makes it less than ideal for a pawn, because Sirash was... Sirash was just using that shit willy-nilly. 
he would use it, he'd bleed out of a stamina, and then he would be gassed, and I don't want that for my pawn. So the question is, do I give him Savage Last, or do I give him Windstorm? I think Windstorm is better, but I'm not sure if he's using Windstorm that well. That's what I liked about playing Magic Archer. I was literally just watching Sirash. Windstorm puts the work in on a pawn. Do they actually, like, hit all the timings, though? It's, it's kind of hard to tell when they're doing... Because we have, you know, we have our, like... We have our fast swings. And it's hard to tell if he's doing that or if he's doing Windstorm. That was the problem I was having. I appreciate your swift return, master. My fell unease begins to gnaw at me when you are gone over long. It is not our place to hurry the Arisen. What are ye doing here? Suppose it must make ye feel a hero. But ye ain't fool enough to think the Empress is safe now I'm in here, are Go on then, and don't come... What's this? Come for another laugh, have ye? Coins a fine thing. Reckon ye must be touched in the head. Still, suppose I got this job by way of... If you want to know who I am in the first place, you... And that was the snake that I already let out of jail. So now I can probably go to the inn and question him. Don't for another laugh, Abby. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait right there. Mm -mm, should be here. If I might be so bold as to speak my mind. Pain I experienced at the coronation was beyond imagining. What baleful art could grant one other than the arisen control over pawns? Pawn uses it better than I do. Like we're traveling. Choose one yeah. elemental affinity, ice. Shall we take stock of our ice. Ice is the best. You'll await me the blanket of ash. Dragons are weak to ice, so it's good. It also freezes stuff, so it's good. I can give you a roof over your head at least. Always a pleasure. Got two of those. What was I about to do? Oh, I gotta deposit those things. You know, so I'd not recommend camping. You'll await me the blank. Of ash. I can give you a roof over your head at least. Uh, I might be better until Nullbreaker gets upgraded. I'll probably be better off using um, Heavenward Sunder. It's 
So what do you have them right now? Windstorm, Mountain Breaker, Lunge, and Tidal Wrath. That's probably good. They can do Tidal Wrath for the counterattacks or have any Lunge to take out annoying shit. I wish the Palm would use in Spirit. I'd love to have him use in Spirit, but it feels like he doesn't use it. Like when I had in Spirit on him, he would be on fire. Like right now. Right now, Sirash is poisoned. You know, so I'd not recommend camping. You'll await me the blanket of ash. All right. I can give you a roof location. Let's see if he'll use it in spirit. Much obliged. Sirash, help yourself. Whatever it is you need, I shall gladly. Sirash, help yourself. Trush in, in spirit. In spirit. In spirit, Sirash. Use in spirit. Like, this is what I'm talking about. Why? Why? Why is he not using in spirit at all? Doesn't make fucking sense, bro. You know, so I'd not recommend camping. You'll await me the blanket of ash. I can give you a roof over your. Why will you not in spirit, Sirash? But also give him Deluvian. He does seem to like to climb on shit occasionally. Aphanite Tomb? What is this? Oh, the Aphanite's Tome. Uh, you could ask Peef. Peef has it. Nah, even in combat he won't use it, bro. I don't know why. Let's give him Deluvian and see if he uses that well in combat. Always a pleasure. Yeah, no, Peeves' character has it, so I'd ask him how he got it. This ladder. So, whoever is truly behind this has covered their tracks well. Might I beg a moment of your time? What I'm about to reveal is not during his interrogation. The br in the name of caution, her majesty has taken up. My plan is thus. You will inform the coral snakes of the Empress's location, and that if they wish to confirm her identity, they must come for you. Who might have the answers we need? Shall we all? Ask around. Simple at palm for a thief pawn? Thief, you can, you can really run whatever you want, and you'll be fine. The only pawn inclinations that I think are important are kind-hearted. You want that if you're playing a uh, mage. And I think for a sorcerer or a ranger, I think calm is a good bet. <laughs> what do you want? You've got the Empress. Suppose the fact you're telling this to me means you're in the know. You, Where should I tell them to find you? Fear not. I'll arrange for the interested party Mark, you know, if you looked at the game for half a second instead of bitching that I didn't answer your question, you would visibly see that I just fast traveled. Sir Arisen, I take it you have given the coral snakes the information we discussed. Then the villain behind Her Majesty's assassination will doubtless be compelled to act with all due haste. And so must we. Let us be. Gonna put that out there. <laughs> 
because the broth will give you a lackluster cutscene and you'd lose a bunch of money. Might I implore you to play the part of a bandit, Sir Arisen? As one of Her Majesty's champions, I have also employed the aid of a woman resembling Her Majesty in stature and build. She will... No, Manella. We must go ourselves. Your Majesty, I don't think... Should the ruse be discovered too soon, the renegade may flee and escape justice. We must confront them, so that our land and its people may ne'er endure such uncertainty again. Mm. I don't know about this. Let's see. Um... So you need to support the Empress. Support her or you get a bad outcome. Understood. Then I shall guard your majesty with my life. We must needs be ready for what air comes, Sir Arisen. It seems you are called upon to act alone. So we pawns shall join your audience. I do hope you play your part well. It is no great shock to me. Yeah, Medusa spawns. The God's way. I suspect the villain will approach under cover of night. I am glad to hear it. Find a way to loosen the villain's tongue. I shall remain hidden till... I am come. Would you kindly... Let us not waste time. I am here to confirm the identity of your... Mayhap this time you use your lantern, master. Indeed. Tis the Empress and none other. Fortunately for you, tis by the Coral Snakes' failure that she... Go on. Kill... Uh... Do I just, like... That is far enough. You must forgive me. I suspected foul dealings from the moment I heard the Empress... Okay, <laughs> I was like, uh... In truth, she cannot die here. We must have her meet her, and in a place more fitting. Tell me, do you know what it takes to inspire action in this world? Tragedy. Yes, tragedy. The Consider what a tragedy of singular measure, such as that of a great... A worthy funeral pyre for an Empress. Wouldn't you agree? So this was your aim. It all becomes clearer. On your knees, we have you surrounded. Sir Armhild, so it was you. Dun, dun, no. dun. This little ruse was your doing, I suppose. And as for your majesty, I must say I am disappointed. You we understand what you desired to achieve. Yet we also believe that no ideal can truly be born from bloodshed. Perhaps you will ponder this in your solitude. By our authority as Emperor. Sir Erm Hills was a vile... What? I... We pity Erm Hild, but... I shall escort Sir Ermhild to her cell. That fool un Let me rest and see if, uh... I feel like there's more to this quest. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, old wager. You can pick some now, and use them when the need arises. I didn't do the Venom quest, but all you get is like a ring that makes you immune to poison, so I don't know if I really care about that one. Any loot at all? 
I'll probably have to go back to, uh, for convergence, I'm gonna need to go either Thief or Magic Archer. Magic Archer can get it done. So I might just do that, do Magic Archer for a little bit, just to knock that out. Nuvo itself is a reason not to like this game. I mean, I'm gonna be honest. I don't. I don't understand the like the anger at Denuvo. I don't know. I feel like I've played plenty of games with with different varying versions of anti cheat, and I don't feel like they've ever affected my enjoyment at all. Like, what is what is so bad about Denuvo? I don't know anything about it. So explain to me why Denuvo is bad. to be there are worse things than turning in and Nuvo makes it not run well what I look for you can feel it on low PCs getting proper rest is an important so is it just like hog performance or something Is it harder to cheat? It eats a lot of memory. Is that it though? Just memory? Like if it was impacting like CPU resources or something, I get it, but like memory? I don't know. Memory is like the least expensive component in a PC build. Like is it just is it is it memory issues or is it other things? Crusher, I ain't using that. I was like, why am I so heavy? That would be why. Found a way to get hard locked. If I didn't have a fairy stone, I think it would have been game over. How did you uh how did you go about this? Impression on me on PC, I'm getting PS5 to play the game, not sure why. Yeah, I don't know either. The Nuvo has been criticized for high CPU usage and excessively writing operations on storage components that later potentially causing lifespan reductions for solid state drives. What the fuck is this? They're just walking around naked. Um, forget it's best you do not speak with pawns here, in, but if you must consult with them, I'd. I'll take any chance not to think. You're welcome, Dean. Well, this is no good. Master, my. We cannot accompany you there, Master. So it sounds like I just don't notice anything with the Nuvo because rig. I 
Archer argument for weak spots depends on your class. Works really well on magic archer. Thief. I jumped into a small island and managed to grab on and climb onto it, but couldn't get back off onto it onto the mainland without falling into the brine. I just kept getting returned to the island and couldn't get off. I mean, you wouldn't be hard locked. You would just have to return to your last end save. You mustn't cause a si yes, I played DD1 and Dark Arisen, and they're on the channel. I want to talk to the Empress. I feel like there's more to the Empress quest line. But I don't know where she's at. She's not in her room. I wonder where this continues. Let me see. Uh, Andal in the storm. Uh, let's see. Um... Hmm. True, she might be in jail. Can you explain how hybrid strength magic stats work on a weapon? Uh, it depends on the weapon. Like, magic archer is primarily magic. So, magic is the important thing. If you're playing something like Mystic Spearhand, though, you have some attacks that are magic and some attacks that are physical. If you're looking at frost daggers, the magic stat is going to boost the amount of frost damage you're doing. Let me go, let me go check the jail. Maybe she's in the jail. I think the jail was over here. Yes, yeah, starting a brand new game would override your current save. Nobody there. Nobody there. Nobody there. I don't see her. I don't see her here. Hmm. Tis good to be reunited. This is the dungeon under the palace. It just connects. Is there, I wonder if there's a follow-up on Mass the Mastermind. Let's see. 
Invader shadowed prayers. Complete a place to call home. Complete a candle in the storm. Okay. Starting to start this quest, return to your home in at night where Vera will appear and ask you to escort the Empress in the city. All right, this says that it occurs in Vernworth, though. Let's try and rest here, and then we'll go to Vernworth. Why do you want multiple saves? There is no port crystal in Bakhbatal. You gotta place one yourself. My graphics are set to just set to max on everything. It appears night has fallen while we slept. Step lively. Journey by starlight. Yeah, I, I would suggest you can put one right here and it's right next to the house. Well? That's what I would suggest. Well, let's go check the house. I'm just looking at this a side quest. We've made it then. What's our first order of business arisen? Let's see if this works. the abode of the good arisen pray pardon the intrusion i am an attendant in the service of empress nadinia her majesty would make a request of you with my gratitude sir um we thank you for meeting us at this late hour sir arisen we require protection of both our person though batal has no official dealings with vermin the count and trouble would undoubtedly ensue should the empress's pre we make for the rose chateau Pray they see us there safely before dawn breaks. Now, let us be off. We ought not to delay our departure any further. Pray remain vigilant while escorting Empress Nadinia. We pawns shan't follow, but you might attract less notice. You have my support. Fancy a look at my wares? I think he's waiting for guards or something. Oh, stomach's complaining. I'll have an early supper. You fancy a look at my wares? Uh, what's what's happening here? Lots to do. Fancy a look at my wares? There we go. Sometimes they get a little buggy. Fancy look at my wares? I beg you. I need that medicine. Can't help you, I'm afraid. My stock's low. But, but my wife. How very cruel. Is there aught we may. You have a kind heart. You're perhaps the good arisen would. Fancy look at my wares? What? A likely story. What a good heart our arisen has. Well, it is a princely, but I'll take it. This is the medicine I need. Oh, happiest. Words cannot express my... That was neatly done, Sir Arisen. Come, we've a ways to travel yet. What 
might you be looking for? This might you must be my fine. winter coat growing in. Your hat always looks like a tower drain, did it? Oi, you lot, help me. I've got a soldier on my tail. If I'd known it was his house, I'd have chosen somewhere else to... You appear before us to beg that we... What do it? You're a beast and come on. Help me out here. Consider it a favor to one of your kin. I've wasted enough time here. I'm just helping thieves. Oh, son of a... Silence, brigand! Tis a hard life these people lead. Yet a kindness granted to a man fallen so f let us press on. We have arrived at last. Now, to attend to the matter for which we have come. We are grateful for your patience. The matter is attended to. We have allies here in the Rose Chateau who offer their aid to our cause in secret. Namely, to create a place where the Beastrons of Vermund may live in peace. Were it to come to light that Batal has provided aid of any kind to Vermund, there would be a scandal, and all of Her Majesty's good deeds would be unmade. Thus, Her Majesty must work in secret, offering her support from the shadows. But let us not linger. I have arranged for an ox cart to meet us by the statue of the Arisen. Do you know before whose likeness we now stand? Is that of Rotheus, founder of Vermont? <laughs> oh yes, was none other than a Beestron who gave rise to this kingdom. Yet, in spite of this history, our people find little welcome here. Quite the opposite, as we have witnessed this night. Past wars twixt Vermund and Batal have done much to worsen Beestrand's standing here. This we cannot deny. Yet, as ruler of a Beestrand nation, we can do no less than long for the day in which our people will be treated kindly wheresoe'er they may tread. And we would be remiss not to pray that the future you envision, as predestined ruler of this domain, shall be in alignment with our own. We bid you good night, Sir Arisen. Alright, so there's that quest. What else do I gotta do? There's one apparently over here that I haven't done. Let me try just resting for the day. There's usually like a soldier that'll just approach and talk to you. You would gather materials here, Master. Can we really afford to carry more? Just wait till the morning and try to get it. I'm like looking through a list of all the side quests in the game, trying to figure out what I haven't done. There's the one where Ragnall shows up. Let's see if we can trigger that. That usually occurs here. This thing just says, return to Vernworth. If you go near the North Vernworth Oxcart Station, a soldier named Simon will eventually approach you. But I've been here a couple times and... Oh, shit. Did you fall down so I can kill you?
Spark of Might! This is my town. Are you Simon? I will see to it that I'm looking for Simon. Is Simon here? Kindly. Can't you see I'm on What business have you here? Sir, how can I be of assistance? Like I said, man, Ark of Might is dope. You just gotta get the perfect timing on it. As long as you use it when something's knocked down and you fucking hit a weak spot, you're good. That's all you gotta do. Don't think you're safe just because you're in the city. One found its way inside the common quarter just the other night. Much blood was spilled before the thing was cold. Drummond and Batala by no means allied. I don't think that quest is going to work for me. It's not popping up. Uh, Beggar's Tale. We did Beggar's Tale. Spring in Thy Step. Sodded Sage. We did. Did I do Sodded Sage? I did Sodded Sage. Out of the forest into the forge. Class and conclusion. What is clash and conclusion? Oh, that's the end of the game one. Risen Shadow I did. Scaly Invaders never popped up. No, Scaly Invaders did. It's the other one that didn't. Um, yeah, I think we're good. I think we're ready to continue towards the end. Ladder can take us to new heights. After you were risen. There's been talk of a mysterious structure rising from the sea. Oh, I'm not sure what to make of it. Mm -hmm. Let's ban him. He's an idiot. Never watched this streamer before, but you've been subbed for 24 hours at least. Okay, buddy. You know where to find. Well met, sir. Farm the dragon blood crystals? No, I got I got plenty, dude. Let's see how many I'm up to now. And you get a shit ton once you get into endgame. We're up to 189. Oh, I'm not sure what to make. Much obliged. The most expensive part of the crystals is just buying the endgame weapons, because they're like a hundred a pop. Okay, let's go to Harv and we'll progress the story. We'll probably have a uh, warrior maxed out pretty soon. Endgame, you'll you'll get plenty of of crystals. Some shit, you're gonna fight. The sort of place that begs exploring. What I wouldn't give for a map, particularly one that could tell us where all the treasure lies. No quarrel here. <laughs> Silly Saurians. I have but two 
judge for that performance. Utter perfection. <laughs> Would that we might always be so in step, eh? Sorry! <laughs> I mean, once you get to end game, you're gonna be farming mats left and right. And the end game is basically just all about farming. Double the Unga. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early Griffin gets the worm. I don't know. I was talking to uh, I was talking to Gaijin about it, and he said he thinks it's, it's ten days. But I feel like I've never been kicked out of it before, so I don't know if I've just always finished up before the ten day mark. Ten days is definitely enough time to, to finish the endgame content, so it may just be that I've always been done before I've been hit with the timer. Fakestone shards are worth their weight in gold when one has enough of them to combine. Must take care not to throw it away by mistake. Are we leaving already? Yeah, like once okay. once I'm in post game, my my uh, approach is going to be to just not rest. Like, unless everybody is fucking dying, I'm not going to rest at all. No time to rest. Lucky us. That's worth taking. <laughs> Bye, idiot. Don't come back. I don't think I can get in there for now. My mistake. It is merely another spot for gathering materials. It's just people are fucking brain dead from this game, Tom. It's the same thing on, on Twitter lately. And I'm just I don't know. I'm out of patience for it, so just ban and ban and block. It's all you can do with these people. It's not worth conversing with them. I had someone earlier they were like like we were talking about Stellar Blade. And how it's, uh, you know, because we played the demo, and I think it definitely has a lot of Sekiro vibes, but I wouldn't consider it to have, uh, actually, hang on, let me get some pants, my legs are cold, give me a second, I'm gonna grab pants and then we'll discuss.
Hang on, I'm dealing with the dogs. Having the people show up for Easter stuff. And the dogs are fucking freaking their shit out. I'm just being idiots. Hmm. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Yeah, but so I'm um, we're sitting there talking about we're we're talking about uh Stellar Blade. And this is this is the thing with fucking people on Twitter, right? People on Twitter you don't even know. They want to come into your replies and, and argue with you. So I was like, you know, I made a post. I was like, you know, after finishing Stellar Blade combat's phenomenal. As the rhythmic parry potential that I've only felt in Sekiro with a little bit of Devil May Cry combos and some special abilities. Very strong first impressions. And someone's like, it's nothing like Devil May Cry. The combos serve no purpose. Combo combat's okay, but Souls fans will like it. And I'm like, oh, I don't think it's a Souls like at all, really. Aside from the, the fact that there's Sekiro vibes in combat. And like, we, you know, we played it on stream, like... I mean, I don't, I don't know. Did y'all, did y'all think Dark Souls when you were playing Stellar Blade? Because I, I didn't. I mean, we're, we're fast as fuck. We're, you know, you don't drop anything on death. We tested that. We got an enemy to half health, died, came back, and he was still at half health. Uh, we got, you know, a map. We're able to ping stuff all, it just, it feels like a cool action game. It doesn't feel like Souls at all. I mean, unless we consider like, you know, there's, there's, big bosses and and uh you know combat hard but like if that's the metric for for what makes us a, a souls like a souls like then you know that's like half the fucking games out these days and then these people they just want to they fuck no you're you're like this motherfucker told me i read this shit it doesn't have the souls lock-on system and combat strafing that's not limited to souls Rest points and enemies respawning. The overall focus of needing to memorize attack patterns. It's 100% a Souls-like. Like, bro, that's fucking... Most games, you're supposed to memorize boss patterns. And, like, dodge. Locking on and, and strafing around somebody isn't something used to Souls. And then the dude was finally like, um... Like, my guy, have you ever played a Souls game before? And at that point, I was done. I was like, alright... I'm just gonna block this fucking moron. There's there's no point arguing with this guy. Like, I'm not I'm not doing this this fucking argument. Tis a chest. But then I got people that are like, oh well you're not you're not engaging with him in, in good faith. You're not listening to his points. Another You're not giving him the chance. And I'm like, what? What I, I did give him a chance. I gave him a chance, and then he goes, Have you ever even played a Souls? Like, dude, there's no, there's no fucking arguing with these people. There's no arguing with them, because they don't, they don't, like, I don't know what it is. I don't know if they just want drama. And I, if someone was even like, you're just not listening to them because you think you're YouTube famous, and so you're, you're, 
point is more important. Like, no, I'm not listening to them because I have extensively put hours into every Souls and Souls-like game there is, and I have a very deep understanding of these mechanics. I'm sorry, man. When 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 someone tells me, have you ever even played Souls? Like, no, the conversation's done. I'm not. I'm not fucking arguing with this person anymore. I've built a career off of fucking souls. Like, why why should I spend any more time arguing with people like this? The answer is you shouldn't. The best thing to do is just fucking block them. You just block them, you ban them, and you don't give them a second thought. The little bro shit is super cringe. I don't I don't know when that started. But that, that shit is so cringe. Someone tried doing that on stream, they're like, okay, little bro, I'm like, I'm old enough to be your fucking dad. Get get back in your lane. Like <laughs> Right now, I'm not maxed out on Warrior, so the skills are kind of less than ideal at the moment. I'd wager this mechanism is incomplete. We must need seek out the lacking the arc component. Title. I'm gonna switch to Mountain Breaker when I get it. And then I was testing out Savage Lash. I hate the term "my guy" or "brother." It makes you want to piss in your face. <laughs> I'll, I'll use my guy. I'll, I'll use my guy. When people say some dumb shit, I'll pull out the my guy. There's combat strafing. It's a Souls like my guy. There's tons of games besides Souls that have combat strafing. I think I should play the first game before Dogma 2. Uh, first game's great. If you're gonna play it, I think it's... I think you should play it before, only because... After playing... After playing the second, the first is probably gonna feel... A good bit more dated. Um, but, the, like, the stories aren't really linked. You can fast travel to Souls. Like, dude, yeah, like... It's... It's crazy. Like, these people take, like, the biggest fucking broad strokes... And then when you're like, no, it's not a Souls, like, they want to, like, fucking piss and moan and argue. Like, just stop. Please stop. I don't, I don't want to have this conversation with you anymore. Splat. every last one. Well, and then the whole thing turned into the, the Sekiro conversation again about how I don't think Sekiro is, is a Souls-like and it's very much its own thing. No, 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 you're not allowed, no. No, uh, you're wrong. Let me tell you why you're wrong. No, I don't care. I'm not interested. No, you're wrong. You have listened to me. Okay. Anyway, Stellar Blade's looking fucking good, though. There's got to be a jail key somewhere around here to open that shit. Five feet away. See, I don't even think of Hollow Knight as a Souls like. I mean, there's Souls Inspiration. I think of Hollow Knight as just a Metroidvania. What could yon chest be hiding? I must know. No soul chests contain treasure, you know. Rurikan's dwarf character had another Rurikan incident. He couldn't jump on an ox cart with the vase from the Sphinx and it broke. That hurts. I know he's feeling that one. I think that the funniest argument is the one where it's like, 
Oh, the game's hard. If it's if it's if the game is hard at all, it's a Souls like like. Bro, you ever play fucking The Lion King on Sega Genesis? Game was hard as fuck. I don't consider Sekiro Souls like either, but that's a, a very hotly debated point in the community. The biggest reasons being that there's no stamina and there's uh there's no builds, which I think are two very important elements of a souls like, you know. Because the whole point of builds in a souls game is like finding your own way through the content, you know? If you're struggling, try switching up your build, try magic, try the dex bleed build, or maybe you stagger stuff with strength and it you just you know blow it up. I think that's a very big part of what makes Souls games so much fun is that freedom of play play in a way that works for you. Whereas in Sekiro, your only option is get good. The same thing with the stamina system. You know, the stamina system directly ties it to the build system. That's a very integral part in how you play in Souls, you know. Because if the fastest, if the biggest sword in the game also swung the fastest and you didn't have any stamina consumption, then there's there's nothing to worry about. But in Sekiro, all of that is irrelevant because it's an action game. But people hear from software and hard game, and instantly their their brains go souls. Must be souls. Hard from soft game souls. Yeah, I don't know, Keith. Doesn't really make sense. Hang on, I missed a chest. There's a chest that has the super dope back. I mean, it's the same with the fucking back, back when Armor Core was coming out, and there was all the discussion about, is it a Souls-like? And then it came out, and it was very obviously not a fucking Souls-like. It's the dumbest shit, dude. Where was that? Where's the fucking thing I want? I think it was over here, but it was higher up. It just loops me around. Is it down on the floor then? Must we run everywhere? You are an impatient one, Arisen. There's a chest that has the cape. Try to keep up. Sirash is wearing, and that's what I'm trying to find. I'm trying to find my my super dope cape. Is it this way? What manner of traps have been set to ensnare us, I wonder? Pray speak up, should you notice all to miss. I know it's here. Hang on, let me see what it's called. Unitor's Mantle. Unitor's Mantle. I found a picture of it. Oh man, this picture is tiny. I can't fucking see it. Picture it looks like it's here. Or there, did I miss it? You think that stigma will make it hard for FromSoft to try and branch out? I think FromSoft is gonna do whatever the fuck they want to do. I don't I don't think FromSoft really gives a shit to be honest. people say it's this from soft is like whatever they don't they don't care from soft just does what they they're gonna do they do whatever they want and they do it good we just opened that you weren't the universe mantle 
This exits. I feel like I'm not seeing the chest because it's nighttime. Let me try and find Janitor's Mantle. I know it was here. All these fucking shitty AI articles. Simply look for the chest and open it. Where? Where exactly? I am here. I do not see it. Is it like here? Like under that? I'm gonna have to like come back during the fucking daytime. This way and out, maybe? That looks like death. Yeah, I would not describe Elden Ring as them milking it. They're they're in the process of making a new game. FromSoft just doesn't talk about their shit until it's like ready. Or about to be ready. No, I got the mage armor chest. There's a chest down here that has the all black cloak, the one Sirash is wearing. And I really like that cloak, and I can't remember where this fucker is at. I remember getting it like as I was leaving. Thought it was there, but that was the major armor chest. Not in those two. Maybe it was up ahead. I don't remember. I remember. It, I don't remember it being up ahead. I remember it being back there somewhere. Let me see if I can find a different listing for Unitor's mantle. Um. Okay, here we go. There's a second chest to be found on the east side of the second floor. This one contains the Unitor's Mantle. Where is my Unitor's Mantle? East side... East side of the second floor. Would be like the south side. It looks like it's just a chest. Hang on, I got a picture. Oh, hang on, I think I see the location. I know where it's at now. So it's called Dragon Spite. There it is. How did I overlook this fucker? Good job, IGN. You contributed. Oh, what luck! Tis a chest! Let us hope your curiosity will be rewarded. Do I have Dragon's Plague? No. Hmm. 
now we got the Godspin. This will seem of little consequence, but you don't know. I said Sekiro is a singular game. You are you are playing as a samurai man. That's it. X builds only. We wanted to play this with the Discord around it has been confusing. Honestly, the majority of the Discord around this is just loud noises. What I understand. The the only Discord surrounding this game that should be talked about is the performance. That's the single-handed most important thing right now. Because there's people that are like buying the game and then their PCs can't run it. And there's no excuse for that. Performance should absolutely be at the forefront of any discussion regarding this game. Anything else? Like, the micros aren't even worth fucking talking about. They're all useless. And Denuvo, I get people don't like Denuvo, but like, Capcom shoves Denuvo in all their fucking games. So if Denuvo's a deal breaker for you, then that's just, you know, you're not playing Capcom's catalog at all. A new day dawns at last. The threat of attack seems more manageable by daylight. That's the thing that's that's so weird about all the the outrage to me at least is like none of this is new shit. Like Capcom puts the nouveau in their games. Capcom puts stupid pointless microtransactions in their games. Like That's just Capcom being Capcom. <laughs> We had to deliver to someone here about. But this time around, people got upsetty spaghetti about it. Pleased with our work. I knew it to be so. I gotta go. Well, we're about to... We gotta go here. Let me go swap my gear up. I'll go Magic Archer for this next part. Actually, I suppose I could just go Warfare. I'm not gonna use the... Oh, am I gonna use the Magic Archer Ultimate? It might help for what I'm gonna do. I wouldn't give for a bowl of hot stew. Everyone just naked ass pawns walking around. Well met. This crowd's good mix. I'm in fine. Well met, sir. How might I be of service? Given the state of things. Where is it at? Spirit coat. Practitioner's hosen. That's the one. I have to close the inner lock. Do come again. Okay. I'm average. I think I just keep my shit on. To be honest. Lose slash res and I gain strike res. So maybe I keep the red one on. Given the state of things, I'm I can play with average, that's fine. I can let me uh, I lower all my other shit. You, you, you. You. 
then I need uh I have to close the inn. Fifteen. I think it's fifteen. They're lost. Do come again. But be sure to buy all. Haven't had much luck today. Interested oh, in my wares? Hoy! No need to over. Oh, thank you. It. You could change it on a whim. Magic archer weapon skills. All right, uh, Sagittate Avalanche, Martyr's Bolt, Recovery Arrow. That should be all I need for upcoming. Zeal, Diamondism, Sustainment, Radiance, Metal. Oh, Sustainment and Ascendancy. It's on a whim, many thanks. You've chosen the path of a magic archer then. A sensible choice. The Arisen's graceful form will find no equal upon the battlefield. All right. I don't think it's a, an engine issue, to be honest. I think it's just that re-engine and this particular style game is very, very intensive. I mean, this is the first time they've tried taking re-engine into an open world game. Which I am curious to see how the Wilds turns out, because Wilds is using the same engine. But you know what? One thing people aren't talking about, like... Bro, this game just doesn't have fucking load screens. Like... So what is what are you screaming about? You have a quest? You are the Vermundian in Her Majesty's good graces. A friend of mine has moved house, leaving a former abode. You see, I have reason to believe a group of into thus have a trusted individual besides or oh, tells me such ne'er-do-wells no i'm not ex oh, i'm not buying your expensive ass house yeah like there's i don't i mean when was the last time you played a game where it's just fucking perpetually dynamic like every cave ever you could run the entire game without a load screen, which that's fucking wild. But when the time comes... They'll probably do some type of DLC. Ah, a new hand, I... Uh. Why this? But why do you possess all that matters? I must oh. make... But wait, no. <laughs> but... Lord Phasus is though I now all the better if it happens. You've returned. Have you obtained any? You yet here you I shall delay. What is it? Right, we gotta rest and then we are good. Is there a bench nearby where I can just rest for a day? That's what I need. I would also really like auto scroll dialogue. You would gather materials here, monster. Can we really afford to carry more? Mm. 
And there's not rarely a loading screen. There, there isn't a loading screen. You get a loading screen when you start the game, and then there's like a background load if you're doing like an inrest or a fairy stone. But like fairy stones happen fast as fuck. A thorough perusal might reveal aught of interest. You could run from Vermond all the way to the volcanic region, exploring every cave, and you're never met with a... No, oh, don't explore this cave yet. You need time to load. Isn't that the Empress? Greetings. There is a task we would trust to none save you we cannot hide our disappointment you just want me to escort you i ain't got time for this i wouldn't consider dozing off in the ox cart a load screen though that's dozing off in the ox cart if you chose to stay awake in the ox cart you're you know the whole game happens in real time It's a relief to be home. Now we've the vim to tackle the day ahead. Off we go then. Mm, hang on, Suraj, do you have any of those? Suraj got a bunch of shit. I hope you slept well. Big boss fight. And no load screens is probably part of the reason, because it's, it's actively calculating the AI and shit for fucking everything. Giant Spartan from the trailer. Um, stay tuned. Talus achievement, best do it with an unmaking arrow? Nah, you don't need that. Magic Archer has it covered. Approaching the end.
Yes, Godsway, Godsway's open the door. And once you beat the game, this door will just, it'll just open in New Game Plus since you have the Godsway. Are you done with DD2 after this live series? Uh, I mean, the Let's Play is still going on for a while. But I'll probably get back to some hell diving for a bit. But we still got we got all of post game still. We still got a we got a chunk of the game left. Talos. If it stayed still, given the size of it, it could crush us all underfoot. I, I'm not sure. I think you can rename them in New Game Plus. Because I know New Game Plus lets you completely remake your character from scratch if you want. I should probably grab a fucking... Uh, grab a thief for this quest. If I see a thief along the road, I'll snag it. But Magic Archer should be fine. I have uh, Sagiate on. of the devil. Is that a thief? Oh, are you the one I was playing with? I think you are. Stand up. I need to talk to you. Damn, it's not letting me interact with them because they're already in the, the thing. I don't need the unmaking error, Fum. I'm a magic archer, bruh. Magic Archer is the goat. Should be focusing fire, but I want to get the chests. Feast your eyes on this. Look out, Arisen. We're under attack. That's one. That's two. What is that? It cannot be. If we do not retreat soon, I fear we are all lost. We all press on, my lord. Mind not the stone puppets, then. We move. Point of no return is coming up, but we're not quite there yet. What could have summoned it? I gotta get ahead of it. My word. What is that? What statue appears to be pursuing the fighter. Of course. The answer was staring me right in the face.
Yeah, we'll be we're gonna be going into post game this stream, I think. I'll probably reach uh I'll reach start of post game this stream and then we'll wrap up there, I think. There's a chest down there, but I'm gonna save time. I'll get it later, because I gotta come back here. Actually, you know what? Here, I could... I can lower my weight by giving all this to Sarash. There we go. Lightweight. Technically, we're very light because of uh, dynamism. Or if the dragon. I don't think the dragon will be up right now. Okay, good. No dragon. Actually, let me get these ones down first. Okay, all we got left is the two uppers. Nope, stop that. Three uppers. Come on. Nope, I don't want you. It's not close enough. Fucker. There we go. Never fear. I am it would. All right. I'll have to kill these harpies off so they don't get in the way. I think, I think we got most of them. I think the last one left is an ankle. Yep, that's it. Oh god. Oh god. Mm -hmm. 
Oh shit, I didn't die there. No, let's go. I believe that is all of them now. Fall back, and I will heal you with my magics. Wait right there. Uh, not seeing any on the ankle, none on the heads, none on the chest. I think we're good. You were worried that we were going to need an unmaking arrow. No, he's already stopped. So that he he progresses via plot to a certain point. So like he's gonna keep walking, but we've already we we've basically finished the fight at this point. He's gonna stop right around here. Feet of the Gigantus in a short span of time. So, there he goes. Suffice to say, not even the Arisen can command it to halt his march. We're done now. Be down. No, no, we don't shoot it with the ballista now. You leave him alone. He is our friend. For reasons. There is, there is a big benefit to stopping it before it reaches the town. Which we will get into in just a little bit. You know, I'd not recommend camping. You'll awake neath a blanket. Bit of ash. I can give you a roof over your head, really. Much obliged. Yes, there is a benefit. You all will see the benefit, likely on the next stream. I don't think we're gonna get that far today. I'd not recommend camping. You'll awake neath a blank. Oh, that goes in. That goes in. Those go in. Kit of ash. I can give you a roof over your Gale Slash. Let's pick up Indomitable. What do you have on right now? What are you using? Diluvian, Tidal, Mountain, and Windstorm. Arc, Heaven Ward. Still not sold on Indomitable. Wish he would use in Spirit. I'd love to give him in Spirit. Much obliged. Material, eh? I shan't deny it. They have their uses. Oh, they took that. I was just thinking, I was like, can I just grab that and stop them? Like, no, 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 come back. I mean, we're not, uh, so we're not at the point of no return yet. We're almost there. But at the same time, if you've made it this far, most quests have already, like, wrapped. The Worm Life Crystal Vendor? I think it just increases your stat gain. But from what I hear from people, stats top out anyway, so I'm not sure on the purpose behind it. A little late to the party, thief. Two warrior bros. I 
I mean, I think the the best use for it is when you reach end game and you're like, I want to just play warrior. Warrior is my jam. It is what I like the most. Nothing else matters to me. You pay for the enhancement for warrior, and then you you don't look back. It's just that. the The skill enhancement is quite powerful. The like pick one skill and and uh, cut the stamina cost of it in half. That one's very good. Better days. The work of goblins may have. One cannot be too careful. Almost there. Almost there. And here. Would seem the stone puppet has stopped. Have the wounded been tended to? Yes, my lord. Good. I trust you are prepared, sovereign of Vermont. W will it really be all right? I I'm not about to be charred, am I? Fear not. You are in no danger. The dragon shall be under my control when it appears. Come. Let us press onward. Now we are at the point of no return. So, you get here, you rest, that will create your free post-game end save, so that you can get the soft ending and get the, the true ending. You'll not believe. I feel refreshed and ready for a new day. Off we go then. I hope you slept well. You're smoking that good ganja. What is it? Has something happened? You ought at least rest for the evening. There should be a spare bed in the lodgings yonder. Only don't go rushing off before you're ready. Take it from me. Your bed. Yeah, that's literally the game telling you, like, hey, this is the point of no return. Make sure you rest. Random NPC being like, bro, don't do it. Go rest. I mean, technically the, the hard point of no return is, is up ahead, but as long as you have an end rest, you're fine. The point is you shouldn't proceed without having an end save. Random NPC, my guy, go make your safe before bad things happen. Yeah, because after after shit goes down here, we're gonna we're gonna do the we're gonna do the uh, the fake ending, and then we'll trigger a post game. I didn't do the quest chain with Ragnall. I wonder if he's going to be here to fight me, or if not. Oh, he's not. Damn it. 
I never got the quest to trigger. So you can fight Rognal here. And you can, like, just beat his ass and then throw him into the pit if you want. I beat his ass and then I brought him back. And the dialogue didn't change. Which was kind of disappointing. I was really hoping, like, beating him in combat and then resing him, he'd be like, you are the truest warrior of all warriors. But nothing. Yeah, I mean, I beat his ass and I didn't get anything for it. But you have to do... I, I never had the quest trigger on this playthrough. The one where you're, like, trying to take the cart and it's actually an ambush surrounding you. I think I... I think I just went too far to trigger it. But somebody in Vermin is supposed to give it to me. And we spent a lot of time in Vermin, so... I'm not sure why it didn't. But I am also not concerned. going after Ron. What is Ron doing with him? Yeet! Your efforts are for naught to reason. Simply watch as this world's hollow and fruitless order is remade by my hand. My guy really thinks he's gonna Ritual control Gagori. You thought that was a dragon? No, no, no. That's not a dragon. That's a fucking snack. This is a dragon. Yeah, I played Stellar Blade. It's on the channel already. Answer me this. 
The waifu! Why dost thou fight? Is it to reclaim thy flesh? This is the well. This is the final part of the base story. We haven't started post game yet, which is like a whole ass new chapter. I offer thee a choice. Grant unto me this life in my claws, and be gone from this place, or stand and. I've never actually like walked away. I think that's the bad ending. The time for thou to make thy choice is come. Show me the path thou wouldst walk. Wonder hang on, what happens if I walk away from the dragon? Let's see, um, Can I? Um, what happens if a player chooses to sacrifice? Let's see, if the player chooses to sacrifice, locked into the bad ending for their current playthrough, walk away from the fight, um, dragon dies. The Arisen ascends the throne as Sovereign of Moon, but the death of their friend will cast a grim parlor over the ceremony. The game ends on a sour note. They are booted back to the main menu. They're encouraged to load the game try again. So it's it's basically the same ending, but sad. No achievement or trophy for getting the bad ending, so skipping it shouldn't pick it Okay. Well, it sounds like it sounds like the actual ending cutscene is the same. You want to fight, dragon? I'm gonna break your fucking toe. No, this is not New Game Plus. Dragon Ball Z shit. We're gonna fight, but not here. We're gonna go somewhere badass. We're not we're not doing uh Godspin yet. Do I think do I get an achievement for it? Should I just go straight to post game? Yeah, I guess we'll do it just to show it real quick. See how the the heart's pumping? That's how you get to the true end. Close paths before thee. 
Oh my god, bro. Come back tomorrow since you want to keep doing dumb shit. No, you can't fall off here. Fall down so I can arc bite you. Stop that. No, he's gonna get up before I can do it. Still some solid damage chunking his head. Whoa, oh. Anyway, heal me. We're gonna cut off his pee pee. Dragon neutered. Because it's it's just the ending, not the true end. This is just here to get you a pretty cutscene and make you feel good about yourself.
That's right, bitches. Celebrate me. It's a different cycle from DD1. Right, the final boss. It's not a very good final boss fight. But that's because we're just prepping up for post game. I'm just doing this to show y'all the the first end. Yes, hello. Good to see you. Good to see you as well. Yes, thank you for your support. Yes, I've come quite far, indeed. Hmm. Ah, uh, how could I forget? Good times. Hmm, yes. Wine, quite good. Keep up those drums. You're doing a great job. Why do you have this zooming in this You have fulfilled your charge, and you need satisfaction. Seek you greater status, perhaps to rule the world entire. It is how you desire you need merely spy out the path. Your choice is thy, Arisen. By thy will alone can the cause of the winners of fate be altered. And that's it. I don't know if we can skip out of this faster. Oh no, he moves. I'll go talk to him again. how you get the true ending without saves coming? I mean, you don't need to save scum anyway, really. You just reload from last in. Extra hundred worm crystals this way? Sweet. Witness with your own eyes, or through the eyes of another, the fate of this world. So I didn't know you could do that. I thought you had to reload the uh, reload the end save to get it. It's interesting that you can keep looping it. This is how you split. You can hear the, the heart beating. Use the sword and the dragon's heart. Oh my god, bro! I never would have figured that out. Thank you for telling me. You mean you mean? Follow the the fact that I I keep glowing and I get close to a big glowy point. Thank God, I don't think I could have figured that one out on my own. 
I'm glad you were here. Says, use the sword on the dragon's heart, then says, I wasn't trying to backseat. My guy, you literally just tried to backseat. No, stay away. Pray, turn back. Leave now while you can. My guy moment. I suddenly made Brant my love interest. Nice. The time has come for you to return. Go. My children shall see you there safely. Let us go home together. To a world under your rightful rule. World all your own. This is your will. Nah, no need for a walkthrough. Your pawns will guide you. A world unmerciful. Post game. The post game reveal is honestly the best part of this game. Because you play the whole game and the title screen just says Dragon's Dogma 1. And everyone's like, oh, it's just like, it's like a remake. They just, you know, it's not Dragon's Dogma 2, it's just a remake. But then, boom, baby! Welcome to Dragon's Dogma 2. Strawberry mango. Very good. These lands in perpetual peace. Yet that world of limitless possibilities has ended. You stand now upon its remains. The vestiges of a world that could have been so much more. Yeah, tutorial's over. Time for the real game. That part of the map is gone.
as it has failed to be chosen, and as to a mare be read, this world will soon cease to exist. In the blink of an eye, the sickle of oblivion will reap aught that you have known. I would advise you not to waste these last moments. Explore the remnants of this world while you can. Perhaps in doing so, you shall come to see the truth and know the wretchedness of a world unworthy of being chronicled. How shall you fare? Vermint elves, but all the volcanic isle. I think Pathfinder is supposed to be like the Seneschal, but it's not completely clear. Yeah, and now all the areas that were covered in water. Here, here, here. You can explore all that. Bunch of whole new areas. I don't think he's here anymore. I think he's already moved. But I'm with Chick. No, you're still here. Seems time to remember. You have, you do have the good shit. That's what I like to see. Uh, you're gonna move to town shortly. But so this is where, this is where you get your badass stuff, like dragon's bite, dark mage staff, dragon's aegis, subjugator salad, executioner greaves, blazing soul. I may get one of these for Sirash and then just keep it up. I don't know. I'm debating. I don't really like the sail scale skin, even though that's uh, the other one. I like the... Uh, there's a different armor for Warrior. Warrior, you have scale skin and the one that he has on, which this is technically better, but I don't like how that looks. What do I need? I don't really need I guess I could get a Grindelmar. No, I don't really need that. Draconic blood flows through the vape. What we could do enhance now. He doesn't have the ability to reset yet. That might be after the, the seafloor shrine. That's just as well. Better to be selective than wasteful. Browsing was enough to scratch the itch in my case. Uh, well, Seafloor is going to have its own, so we'll just pick this guy up. Let's run by Seafloor. Is that a Gore Chimera? Or a regular Chimera? Either way, I'm going to kill it. I'll beat its ass. How do I reach you? Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our favor. Let my magic grant you an elemental boon. The end game is a whole different ball game because there's no. I see fairy stones left and right. There is no uh, like night or day cycle. Everything is just like worlds coming to an end. And you can see we're finding fairy stones fucking constantly. I will protect you. We're gonna run here. We're gonna get our... I'll probably go get my pawn back. Yeah, I don't know. Ow. Get. 
not, I'm not wasting my time on basic skellies. I got bigger shit I gotta fight. I've heard different numbers too, so I don't know exactly what the time frame lock is. Where's seafloor exactly? That's what I'm trying to get to. But I kind of want to go get that Chimera first. No, I should get back uh, Sirash first. One of us has been silenced. So let me go get this, the Riftstone, and then I'll come back for Chimera. what I'm getting. I'll talk to you soon. I gotta get this. Oh, hang on, that's the rift crystal. Where's the, the warp? The warp's over here, I think. Where the hell's it at? It's the Grand Rift Stone. That's not what I want. You would have us press on without delay. By your will arisen. Little does our foe realize how narrowly they escaped death's touch. Actually, let me just talk right to him first. No longer do I feel the probing gaze of the watching one. Is this your doing? Newest of the arisen? I am he who brought the dragon low. And o'er its bones raised the proud kingdom of Vermin. Despite the magnitude of my feet, I was dissatisfied and sought air greater heights, till at last I ruled the world entire. Thus did I come to know of the Watching One. The being by whose many eyes and ears no one or thing in this world goes unobserved. As to the purpose with which they watch, I know not. Yet I did divine one thing. This world has lain neath the watching one's unwavering gaze ere the dawn of its history. despaired at this discovery for if all is but a stage did that not render my hard won glories my throne astride the world mere spectacles for the all seeing eye to watch I twas was all a farce and I the fool exulting in my wooden crown do you understand, newest of the Arisen? Alas, though I cut down all who seemed false, indeed, my efforts led only to my own ruin. I was dubbed the Mad Sovereign, and by the hand of the new Arisen, consigned to this place forevermore. Yes. I can only assume that you have how else to explain it. Ah, oh, what bitter fault are not and fading spirit. I see you have returned, Arisen One. The Mad Sovereign has called, and so we answer. If you would save the people of this world from ruin, for this place may chance. Making this a place of refuge is a splendid idea. There it is. It's safe. Apt to become quite cheerful once the crowd settles in. You have my support. Okay, the first thing to do 
is go to Bakbatal. That's where we get our our uh, pawn back. We seem to have a ride with Without issue, but are we safe here? No, not quite. But all right, this seems like a pretty good spot to wrap now that we are officially into the post game. Let me actually uh, deposit stuff, so I'm not overburdened. So we'll close out here. We are finally at the post game. Dragon's Dogma 2. You don't get that title screen until the end. But yeah, we will uh we'll jump into this tomorrow when I get off work. Got to save save all the people and then get all the bosses and all the rare loots and that should be dope so i'll catch y'all then